The Goliath frog is the largest frog in the world. The Goliath frog is an endangered species of frog that lives exclusively in Equatorial Guinea and Cameroon in Africa. It can also be referred to as a Goliath bullfrog or a giant slippery frog. This amphibian got its name due to its large size. These amazing creatures can grow to be about the size of a pet cat. Goliath frogs are endangered. Goliath frogs can leap forward 10 feet. Goliath frogs are nocturnal. Goliath frogs move heavy rocks to build nests. Female Goliath frogs are smaller than males. The Goliath frog is sometimes confused with the African bullfrog due to some similarities the two species share. For example, both of these frogs are native to Africa, are carnivorous, and are much larger than many other frog species. There are, however, more than a few distinguishing differences between these two frogs. First, although the African bullfrog is considered one of the largest frogs, it is significantly smaller than the Goliath frog. African bullfrogs typically weigh just over 2 pounds and measure between 4 and 9 inches in length. Another example of how these species differ is the loud croak an African bullfrog makes. Additionally, African bullfrogs hibernate in the dry season whereas Goliath frogs do not. These frogs have bumpy skin that contains glands and which they use to drink water and obtain oxygen. The upper side of the animal's body is called the dorsal side, while the bottom side is referred to as the ventral side. The dorsal coloring is usually a brownish-green color with various spots. The ventral coloring can be either yellow-green or yellow-orange. Their coloring helps to camouflage themselves with their environment. As a mature adult, these frogs can reach up to 32 centimeters long, which is six times the height of a golf tee. Their weight can vary between 1.3 pounds, about three times as heavy as a hamster, and 7.2 pounds, about half the weight of a bowling ball. These frogs are solitary animals. These amphibians can swim very fast but will often wait around for prey to catch with their long tongue. They can leap large distances, up to 10 feet, despite their tremendous size. They are also quite strong. They are able to move heavy rocks to create nests, sometimes over 4 pounds. This is likely the reason these creatures evolved to be so big. These frogs are native to Africa. The range of their habitat is limited, existing only in the regions of Cameroon and Equatorial Guinea. Their natural habitats are freshwater and tropical environments, within the rainforest and near rivers. They can also be found in zoos around the world, such as the San Diego Zoo and the San Francisco Zoo, both located in California. Adult frogs are carnivorous. They eat a variety of organisms such as insects, fish, crustaceans, mollusks, amphibians including smaller frogs, and sometimes small mammals. Some of the species these frogs like to snack on include dragonflies, worms, spiders, newts, salamanders, crabs, and small snakes. These are just some examples of their diverse diet. It has even been documented that one of these giants had eaten a bat. Therefore these frogs could have additional prey that is not yet known to researchers. Tadpoles are herbivores and feed on only one plant species called Podostmaceae, which is a type of riverweed found in tropical habitats. The only known predator to these frogs is humans. However, Potential predators include large lizards such as monitor lizards, crocodiles, and snakes. Tadpoles may become prey to a few predators including birds, snakes, dragonfly larvae, and hedgehogs. Humans are the biggest threat to these frogs. Hunting these frogs for their meat and exporting them in large numbers for the pet trade have been the two main contributing factors to the decline of this species for many years. 
farming and development are also destroying their natural habitat. As their habitat continues to degenerate, their population declines as well. These frogs mate through sexual reproduction and lay eggs, similarly to other frog species. Before mating, male frogs will build a nest for the offspring. Sometimes the male moves large rocks to create the nest. The male frog uses a call that is different than most other frogs. This is because this frog lacks a vocal sac. Instead, a whistling sound is what is produced from his mouth. Once the couple mates, the male frog goes on his way. The female frog lays several hundred to several thousand eggs. After 85 to 95 days, the eggs hatch, and tadpoles are released into the water. The mother frog does not take care of her tadpoles the way other animals would care for their young. They are independent and must find their own food. The tadpoles reach maturity around 10 to 12 months old. These frogs usually live around 15 years in the wild. Although there have been goliath frogs that lived to 20 years in captivity, they do not thrive when not in their natural habitat. Unfortunately, it is unknown exactly how many of these amazing animals exist in the wild today. What is known, however, is that the population has been decreasing steadily and continues to do so. According to IUCN, the International Union for the Conservation of Nature, the status of this frog is endangered and is included in their red list of threatened species.